Welcome back, my friends. We are going to end the turn soon. Uh, but first, I think I want to recruit a few units for this guy. Uh, and we'll recruit some Noblar Trappers, and then we'll get rid of the regular Noblars. Kind of keep an equilibrium of four Noblars, but switching them to Trappers. And I think that'll be fine. Now, diplomacy-wise, uh, I do realize that we have a trade agreement with Fulg here which is not actually ideal because I want to take Firemouth and uh, Blackfang uh, because I want to take Carcassorn and they are in the same province so that trade agreement is, is going to go away but maybe we can make a trade agreement with this guy uh, so trade agreement and let's see balance no we're not going to be paying you that you're <clears throat> we'll we'll have to wait with that we'll have to wait with that so let's end the turn and see what happens uh so this is actually bloodmore who i was wasn't that Who I wanted to make a trade agreement with? I think it was. Uh, I can't balance the offer. I can't make this offer. Uh, what if we remove the payment? Balance? They want 1150 for this trade agreement. I don't want to do that. Um, oh, oh, uh, not aggression pact. No, uh, let's uh, cancel this for now. I wouldn't mind a non aggression pact with them, but okay, if someone came out of in stance, uh, encampment stance. Who is coming? Uh, that's the prince guy. Ambushes are discovered. We have detected a forest belonging to the Baleful Prince's muses attempting to lay an ambush in Firemouth. Okay. Uh, technology research. Camp growth plus five. Nice. That is very, very nice. So. Let's take a look at our camp here. Oh, God, tyrant. Uh, are you about ready to grow? One turn. In one turn you're ready to grow. We ain't happy. Okay, so you have plus 85. Leader of the tribe. Uh, you have plus 25. Which isn't a whole lot. Uh, Alright. We can build a new building here. Which I think we decided not to do. Oh, we tore down a building, didn't we? Um, Grim Top. You don't have the... Mm. So local armies, is that local in the province or local in the region? I hope it's local in the province. Hmm. Don't really need the growth anymore. Not that much, anyway. Control might be nice. I don't think I need the meat. So we'll do that. We can't build anything else. 
uh, for you. We will disband. Ooh, can I offer to the Great Maw? Okay. So give me Gut Ring, Winds of Magic Power, Reserve plus five per turn, Global Recruitment Duration minus two turns, minimum one. Campaign movement range plus 20%, melee attack plus 10. Okay. So I, I don't think we need to make an offering uh, with him right now. We'll disband you. And we will recruit two more of you. Alright, just had a thing in my throat. Needed to clear out. Okay, so we're recruiting there. And over here, are we at war with uh, the Baleful Prince? I mean, we, we see his... We're not at war with him, but... We could be. Let's see. Uh, we have to declare war. I think we could take him relatively easily. But I kind of want to attack you guys. And we're just going to auto resolve that. Six meat, some nice treasury, some experience. Not that much, much experience, but experience is experience. Okay. And we will... Let's just replenish. Right, now we need to go deal with these two as well. But I really want to deal with the Baleful Prince as well. So it looks like a relatively easy victory. We've got campaign movement range plus 7%. Wow, that is nice. All right, now let's take a look at that. Uh, did he get in here? We have the pit fighter. And we have the nobler chief. Uh, we do not have you. That takes away the nobler chief, but that's fine. Uh, what we could do is possibly give you the Noblar Chief. Yeah. Because recruit grant plus four for Noblar units, and we are recruiting Noblar there right now. I think that works out nicely. There's no gap bigger. Okay. The Over Tyrant. Now we could try and combine something. And let's not do that right now. Alright, so I think we're going to attack you. Alright. He ran away. Catch him. Decisive victory. We won't lose anything, so we'll just auto resolve. Alright, free me. Some treasury. Not very much. 
and some experience. Uh, actually, some quite nice experience. So that's all good. And they're gone. Rayback Pelt. Melee defense plus 10 attribute strider. Strider speed and combat diplomacies caused by terrain are ignored by this unit. Okay. I can dig it. Uh, Brewer. Control plus one in the local province. And we destroyed the Baleful Prince's muses. Gracious. This shockingly outbase. Now I'd really like to attack those guys. The Alvatarin Alright. Oh, wow. So that's all done. Uh, we do have a level up. Bosses. And we're going to grab Uber Chat Tyrant. For sure. We have a level up for you as well. Tribe Stealer. Hold Master. Let's get. Vanguard deployment for them. For the Saber Tusks. Alright, we can research Bigger Spit, Control plus 4. Diplomatic Relations plus 10 with Ogre Kingdoms isn't bad. I don't do raiding really. Hmm. Income from old buildings plus ten percent, and I do like the control, it so we'll go us. with that. It helps me. And I suppose we'll end the turn. Okay. I call the shots here. Get out if you don't like it. What was this? Non-aggression pact from Fulg. No. We're going to decline that, because we want to attack Fulg. Okay. Many apologies, your great Balkanist, but I bring news. The Black Orc war boss seeking to take these mountains for his own has been lured to the fire mouth as you requested. Now is the time to crush him. Okay. Quest issued. Uh, win the following battle with Greece's Goldtooth's army. Okay. Uh, what are the enemy forces? Goblin archers. A lot of ranged, which isn't great for us. Um. Uber Tyrant's Crown. Allegiance points gain plus 10% for all alliances with Uber Kingdoms. Control plus 3, all provinces. Melee defense plus 3, physical resistance 10%. And uh, Uber Tyrant's Crown passive ability, which is damage resistant plus 5 in plus 5% in an area. Alright. Uh, we'll, we'll do that, but not right now. Um, okay. So reached. Now, I want to go take out this uh, camp. Then we... And I am pretty sure we can auto resolve the this. There we go. Wow, a lot of gold. Nice. Meat. And I think we'll go with the unit replenishment. Dinner is served. All right. Audacious. Leadership plus five. Charge bonus plus five. Nice. Uh, enemy killed in battle. Oleg. Elf poker. And morgue. And we destroyed the cross clubs. Good. 
that was what we wanted. No guns bigger. Uh, let's pull back a little bit. Spoils here. So that we don't consume our meat. And we will... That's why I'm in charge. Well, let's see. We can do Sabertooth packs now. So I think I want to... Disband a couple of you. Maybe three, actually. Yeah, three. Maybe I should eat them. And then we will recruit the Sabertoss packs. So that we have those. And I think that'll be a nice addition to choice. our army. It's not a choice. Uh, let's see, what do we have up here? Priest Noblars, 3 plus 10%. Don't really think I want to do anything for the Noblars. And I think this bull charge was a mistake on my part. Because I don't think we'll be using those in the future. So, armor plus six for saber touch packs, stone horn, gorgers, and giant units. That's very nice. Charge bonus plus four. Best eaters plus two melee attack and plus two melee defense for iron gods and man eaters. And I think that is. It's one of these two that we want to go for. I think I'll go for the beasts. Valuable, all heavy. Okay, Lord not moved. That's you. Uh, you can... Can you recruit something? No. Well, you can, technically. We'll take two turns, but that's fine. <clears throat> So let's get some saber tusks in there for you. And that'll be fine. Uh, building upgrades. We have one and it'll grow in one as again so that we can get up here. And I think I want to wait for that because... Um... I think we want to get maybe the pack cave here as well. Maybe go for the man eaters. Because armor piercing would be very nice to have. Uh, Stonehorn, Stonehorn, Giant, Hunter, Gorgers. I want some Iron Guts as well, and that will necessarily... I think we don't need to build anything here right now. What about in our Even other settlements, though? Thomas. We can upgrade the Fire Shrine to get some more control. And that's about it. And we'll skip that, and then it's end turn. Alright, Fire Mouth is coming out. I'm the Overtyrant. That means I'm in charge here. Ah, oh, you know. Uh, so... The Sargs want a agreement. Uh, you know what? I am fine with that. We have a non-aggression pack with them. Alright, mission successful. Recruit 20 new units. Fantastic. We get... 3,000 treasury and cannibal totem. Melee attack plus 10 and weapon strength plus 10%. Nice! 
Okay. The savage blow. Uh, many conflicts are won or lost on the strength of the first vicious charge. Menacent flying from the battlefield often in pieces, even before the savagery of melee begins. A well charmed charge shatters enemy morale as well as bodies. Blood and sweat may coat the victors, but victory is always painted in colors such as these. Those at the head of the charge seek ever greater thrills, ever more bloodshed, as the battles become bigger, the body count grows higher, and trickles of blood become ever flowing rivers of red. Charge bonus plus 10 plus, plus 20 for all armies of all factions. Faction wide, okay. Alright, we got the cannibal totem. Which is fine. Uh, let's grab you. Um. Kind of want that cannibal totem. Over here, which means we lose the gleaming pennant, and then we lose the banner of Swiftness. Okay, I want all of them. Uh. Over tyrant, Greece's gout. You can have the pit fighter. And you can have the Noblar Chief. No, no, no. Yet. Alright. You can have the Grey Pack Pelt. Alright. That's fine. We're at full strength here, and I kind of want to go attack Karak Asorn. No, 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 no. I want my army to go attack Caracas Horn, and we will declare war on them. Mm hmm. Conquest. What do they have? Well, that's not too bad. I can't quite get there right now. I don't think they can get to our Amble Peak either, but what we can do is move you up. Can't you move? Oh no, because you're recruiting. Dang it. Okay. Okay, uh, how is Amble Peak looking? Uh, garrison wide? Not great. Not great. Oh, we have a building upgrade available in the Great Hall of Greece's camp. And we're going to upgrade this for sure. That's going to be wonderful. And in the Great Hall of Greasus, we only have one. Well, we can we can upgrade you. And then I don't think I want to build you just yet. Do I? I mean, this is the income building. Uh, Amble Peak is on the edge of...
think we'll go with the walls. Okay. Emble Peak is the one at risk. And I guess we'll end the turn here. Alright, Targog, go take him out. Oh, well, you didn't take him out, but you must have done some damage to him. Alright, Thor, Thunder Guts. Uh, well, we'll balance that. We shall feast. All right. So, where's Scory going to go? Oh, what is this? Who are these guys? Chameleon. I guess it's Cathay, but I don't know. But he's marching. That's fine. No, 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 don't go away. We were supposed to kill you. All right, and the negotiator. Treasure reward from contracts plus 15%. Okay. Must face. Well, you're heading in here. So there's a Pyrrhic victory. Uh, Rampage is standard. So that's assigned. The others are not. Uh, so the Rampager standard is the charge bonus, which I guess is actually not fine. I want that on one of you. Leadership plus seven we can put on there. Melee attack plus 10, weapon strike plus 10% will go on you, I think. Uh, then we have leadership plus 4. And what's the other one? Speed plus 20%. I kind of like that on those. Alright. Um... Okay. Do we continue the siege? I think we continue the siege for now. Okay. I know it gives him time to maybe come down and help. No. Let's have you come up here. And we'll recruit. I think we'll recruit one more of you. I actually think that's it. Yeah. Uh, can you go in an ambush stench? No. Alright. Fair enough. Let's end the turn. So I think we can defend whatever he throws at us. This gory mm -hmm. guy. Oh, I forgot to go take a look at these guys. Kind of wanted to do that. They look weird. All right, Scory, what are you gonna do? 
Gonna head that way, okay. Thingrim Iron Will, where are you going? I need to kill you. Ally begins outpost construction. Thunderguts. Your ally Thunderguts has begun construction an outpost in your settlement, Great Hall of Breezes. Once the construction completes, their units will join the settlement's garrets. Nice. Alright, we got the bigger spit. I am the tenderizer. Uh what do you have? You have 14 units. Most of them are half dead. I think we could possibly take this. We have 17 units. Um, they have quite a lot of armor. And we don't have any armor piercing. Basically. Which isn't great. Right, so I think we are going to go and attack here. It says it should be a close victory or a Pyrrhic victory, but I think it's worth it. Ah, uh, he ran. Dick. All right. Conquest. Well. I kind of feel like we have to go up here. Why, why can't you move? But why can't we move up there? We are not in any kind of stance. Oh, we are, we are, we are, uh, uh, it's a close victory. Uh, it says we won't lose anything but it's first time we're fighting anything but uh ogres so i think we'll do this and we'll go with some pre-battle feasts speed plus 10 percent unit mass plus 10 percent charge bonus plus 10 percent let's fight the battle let's do this Let's do this. All right. Looking forward to fight some dwarves. All right, we can come in from two sides. It's looked like it looks like, um, which I think we will. I think we'll come in from both sides, and I think that'll be good. Okay, so let's see what Your we have here. Up and ready to attack. The enemy fortifications are formidable, but with perseverance they may be overcome. Drive out the foe and claim this place for yourself. Right, major sea battles are fought over walled cities. The attacker can capture the city by either rooting all defending units or by capturing and holding one or more victory locations. Learn more about major siege battles. All right, let's take the uh, the tour real quick. All right, uh, that's fine. Then we have uh, walls. Four of our settlements are surrounded by walls in which the defender may position troops to resist the attacker. During a major siege battle, the attacker must either scale the walls using ladders or siege towers, breach the walls, or circumvent the walls by attacking the gates. Yep, understood. In case present key points of weakness that may be assaulted with battering rams, artillery, or melee units. Yep. Uh, fortified towers. Towers will aid the defenders in a major siege battle by automatically firing on seconds as they approach. When controlled, the missile fire of a tower may be directed by left click the icon above the tower and right clicking the desired target. The attacker may capture a tower by gaining control of its capture point location and then turn its fire against the defenders. Good, good. Uh, capture locations, yeah, blah blah blah. We know that. Uh, constructed defenses, yeah. Uh, major victory locations, 
Uh, okay, so the major victory location is up over that on that lookout thing, and then we have some key buildings. Okay, fine. Let's see. We need. I think we'll put you in group one, you in group two, and we'll put you in group three, you in group four, you in group five. And I think that's fine. So, over here on the other side. I want to attack on both sides. So we'll put you four over here. Together with you two. And I think you three as well. And our hunter. Uh, hunter, can you please face the right way? And then over on the other side, we'll have the rest. And that'll be you five, who will be here. The Noblars can go here. Uh, come in there. Uh, you. Come in there. And I guess you can go in here as well. Alright, let's start the battle. Uh, even the walls uh, of a fortress cannot the withstand their mighty no, guns. No. Press your attack. Let's move forward. Actually, let's just attack the gatehouse, shall we? And the same over here on this side. Attack the gatehouse. Get that thing going down. Okay. Uh, you can attack that. And you can attack those. Okay. We are in on the gate. Is it down already? It's down already. Wow, that was fast. All right. Uh, let's just pull you back for a second. I want the Noblars in there first. Because their job is to die. Get in there and engage something. What are you going to engage though? Whoa. Alright, they're through. We are taking the victory location. So, are we through here? We are. Alright, uh, let's get everyone through here. Just come in there like that for now. Over on the other side. We have those guys in. Let's get all of you in. And you can come in. And attack. Fattest, strongest, richest. 
Okay. We're through. We took the victory point, which is great. Let's get you guys in here. Where's the enemy? I don't see an enemy anywhere. Over on this side. N nothing. Okay. Take them out. Where is our you? You're in there. Okay, good. I'm pretty sure this is going to be a win. Uh, Croesus, why don't you? Go help. Uh, you two, fire on those. Come over here. And fire on those. And you guys, you can attack those long beards. Yeah. And. We have a tower now. Don't we? And we need to get up there and take it. Okay. Fair enough. Um, let's do that there. Alright, that took a bit out of them. They seem to be very unhappy right now. Uh, we have taken this location. I want my saber tooths. Why don't you come in here? Uh, saber tooths. Come in here. Why are you uh, in a frenzy? Right, move up. The hunt continues. Rampage this way. Oh, we have Thundering some of these guys here. So why don't you guys go attack them? And you guys can attack them as well. How's it looking over here? looking pretty good all right get that guy don't think he's gonna like the stone horn uh, coming in on top of him but that's his problem not mine Trappers, they are taking up those. Can you please keep attacking him? You get back in here, I guess. Nah, it's really not needed. All right, it's a victory. Nice. I don't feel like it, it went too badly. I think it went pretty well. Decisive victory. Very nice. End the battle. I like it. We lost 200. We lost 487. Who was MVP? Uh, you guys. Okay. Our saber tooths or saber tusks didn't really get to do anything. Stonehorn obviously did quite a bit. Okay.
So all the battle was basically on one side. There was nothing to do on the other, more or less. That's fine. Good, good, good. Let's take over Karak Asorn and see what we can build there. Yeah. yeah, it was basically all on one side. It was basically all on one side. The Iron Guts did quite well. 76 with basically no casualties. I have to say, I'm really enjoying the ogres. They're a, they're a lot of fun to play. A lot of fun to play. And look at the dwarves here, man. They were just annihilated. They were annihilated. It's beautiful things to behold. Beautiful things to behold. Okay. Four meat, that's not a whole lot. That didn't even cost our pre-war pre feast. Pre-battle feast. Alright, rent gain 12. Not bad. And we are going to occupy you. Make yourself an own boy. Yeah. Big name unlocked. Big name gate crasher. Nice. We got a p another pit fighter. Okay. And we have Caracasorn. What's he what? Do we have we have these guys? I don't mind having those. Uh the meat store. Caracasorn Great Hall. Ooh. Dwarf beer resource. Production 45 kegs control plus 10 income from all buildings plus 10% in the province. Nice, that's something we want. And then we have the meat generation building, which is not bad. So I think we will go with that. I don't think there's any need to do anything. Uh, what we could do, I don't think. Oh, it's all do uh, we can't move right now can we okay, we do have a level up and we are level 12 now so we're going to we're going camping uh grand camp growth plus five and then next we're going better camping and then we're going the best camping uh so camping it is mine absolutely uh, we need to research a new technology because we've got bigger spit. Uh, and we're going to get the protection racket now. Plus 10% income from all buildings. I this like it. Uh, you have a level up as well. Gutsy. And then all the Noblar stuff. Um... I think immune to psychology. Yeah. All right. And up here, you can't move in and do anything. We have building upgrades available at the Great Hall of Greece's camp. So... I think we will get the pack cave. And I guess we'll upgrade everything. Um, Camp growth plus 13. Uh, meat generated 7. I'll keep minus 20%. Why didn't it choose that? We have the money for it. So loot hoard income generated 400. Very nice. Okay. And we need 
eight population surplus surplus to upgrade this. Jesus Christ. That's expensive. But that is well worth it. We, we only have one population surplus here, but next turn we will have another. Amble Peak might be in a spot of trouble. Ah, it does have quite nice uh, quite nice garrison. I'd like to crack a 10 to have a better garrison as well. So this is this one that we went with. I think this one is better. But for now, it's nice with the growth. And let's head down here to the Sea of Dread and see what the heck these guys are. Oh, we can't see their units. Skink Chief. Okay. I have no idea what those guys are. Barter here. That's our allies. Okay. Well, we took Karakasorn. And I want to kill Thingrim. Uh, I don't suppose you can recruit anything you can, as a matter of fact. But do I want to recruit anything? I suppose I do. It's just great for the two of you. All right, and that is where we are going to end the episode for today. We took Karakasorn, we destroyed, we killed the demon prince thing, and we are chasing down Scory Stonebeard, who hopefully doesn't go attack Amble Peak. But if he does, he will be fighting a pretty sizable garrison. So hopefully that'll be okay. But yeah, uh, thank you so very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.